Here we have a pre-calculus question. Okay, let's go the information. Find a and d for the function f of x equals to a times uh, cosine x plus to d, so that the graph f matches the figure. Okay, here uh, the cosine x is multiplied by a, so depending on the value of a, so the graph may be reflected, or uh, uh, and also there must uh, there must be a vertical stretch or compression, and uh, this positive d represents a vertical translation. Uh, it may be up or it may be down, but there is no horizontal translation or horizontal stretch or compression because we just have x over here. Okay, so to get the value of a and d in the given function, uh, let's consider uh, the graph of the basic uh, cosine function that is f of x equals to cosine of x. So the graph of the basic cosine function is, uh, it will look like this. That is a one pattern of the graph of uh, this cosine x will look like this. Okay, so that is uh, to the right side of uh, the x-axis over here like this. So this is x-axis and uh, it's a y-axis. So the amplitude is one and here uh, it's uh, negative one. Okay, that is the minimum value has to be negative one, the maximum value has to be positive one. Okay, so this is how the graph of the uh, function f of x equals to cosine x will look like this. Okay, so when I look at the graph over here to the right side of uh, the y-axis over here, so compare this pattern and the pattern over here, it has been flipped. That is a graph or the graph of the basic function of, uh, I mean, uh, basic cosine function has been reflected over x axis. So, whenever we reflect over x axis, the value we have in front of uh, the cosine must be negative. So, the value of a must be negative. Okay, so first let's find the value of a. So, to get the value of a from the given graph, what I need to do is I have to consider the maximum value and minimum value. So, what is the maximum value? Clearly, it's uh, negative 5. The minimum value is a negative 13. So to get the value of a, what I need to do is I have to first I have to write the maximum value and I have to subtract the minimum value uh, from this uh, maximum value and I have to uh, divide this result by 2. And for this complete result, I have to take negative sign. So this is the value of a. So for this complete result, I am taking negative sign over here because uh, the graph of the basic cosine function has been reflected over here. That's why I am saying the value a over here has to be negative. So you basically to get the value of a, we will subtract the minimum value of y from the maximum value of y and divide the result by 2. But in this case, I am taking the negative sign over here because there is a reflection over x-axis. Okay, now let me take the negative sign. And uh, the maximum value already we have discussed, the maximum value of y is uh, negative y negative the minimum value of y is negative 13 uh, over 2 so equals to negative let's simplify this one negative 5 so this negative times it will become positive 13 over 2 so when i subtract uh, 5 from 13 uh, that is when i simplify this negative 5 positive 13 it will become uh, positive 8 but there is a negative sign over here so 8 over 2 so finally it becomes when you divide 8 by 2 4 but there is a negative sign that is negative 4 now i got the value of a a is negative 4 Okay, now I have to get the value of D. How can I get the value of D? So that's very simple. What I need to do is I have to find the average of the maximum value of Y and the minimum value of Y. Uh, that is, uh, I have to find the average of negative Y and negative 13 to get the value of D. So D is equal to uh, maximum value, positive minimum value of Y divided by 2. So the maximum value of Y is negative 5 and the minimum value of Y is uh, negative 13 and it has to be divided by 2. So negative 5 can be written as this positive times it will become negative 13 over 2. And uh, when I combine them, I'm getting negative uh, 18 over 2. When I divide negative 18 by 2, I'm getting negative 9. And also, which is called the middle line over here. The value of D represents uh, the middle line. Okay, so now I got the value of D. The value of D is uh, negative 9.